Hello viewers and welcome to the world of cryptocurrency, where Bitcoin reigns supreme. As digital currencies continue to reshape the financial landscape, myths and misconceptions have proliferated. In this video, we embark on a journey to debunk common Bitcoin myths, offering clarity and expert insights. So without further ado, let's dive into the video and subscribe to the channel. Myth number one, Bitcoin is a bubble. While it's true that some people buy Bitcoin as a speculative investment seeking big returns, that doesn't necessarily mean that Bitcoin itself is a bubble. Bubbles are economic cycles characterized by unsustainable rises in market value, typically followed by a dramatic crash when investors realize that the prices have far exceeded the asset's fundamental value. Bitcoin has occasionally been compared to an infamous early speculative bubble, the 17th century Dutch tulip mania. In 1637, speculators caused prices for some tulip varieties to surge 26-fold within a short span of time. However, this tulip bubble lasted only six months, crashed, and never recovered. The Real Story Bitcoin has experienced multiple price cycles over its existence, spanning more than 12 years. Remarkably, it has recovered from each cycle and reached new highs. Similar to any emerging technology, boom and bust cycles are par for the course. For example, at the end of the dot-com era in the late 1990s, Amazon's stock plummeted from around $100 to just $5, only to eventually become one of the most valuable companies globally in the subsequent decades. Some prominent Bitcoin investors believe that Bitcoin's price oscillations follow a pattern typical of young markets. They suggest that Bitcoin will undergo surges and retreats with smaller fluctuations and longer durations between them until, at some point in the future, it settles into relative stability. However, only time will tell whether this prediction holds true. Myth number two, Bitcoin has no real world uses. Critics often claim that Bitcoin lacks utility in the real world, or if it serves any purpose, it's primarily for illicit activities. Both of these assertions are inaccurate. Bitcoin has a lengthy history of facilitating global payments without the need for banks or payment processors, and it is increasingly being adopted as a hedge against inflation by major institutional investors. The Real Story In recent years, Bitcoin has gained popularity as a store of value that can resist inflation, much like gold. This has led to Bitcoin being referred to as digital gold. Numerous major funds and publicly traded companies, including Tesla, Square, and MicroStrategy, have invested billions of dollars in Bitcoin to manage their assets more effectively. Unlike physical gold, which is cumbersome and challenging to transport and store, Bitcoin can be digitally transmitted as easily as sending an email. While Bitcoin initially received negative attention as a means of payment on the dark web, its price actually increased after the closure of the first major dark web marketplace. Moreover, illicit use of Bitcoin represents only a small fraction of its overall transaction volume. According to a recent report, criminal activity accounted for just 2.1% of Bitcoin transaction volume in 2019. Because all Bitcoin transactions occur on a transparent blockchain, it is often easier for authorities to track illicit activity compared to the traditional financial system. Myth number three, Bitcoin doesn't have real value. Although Bitcoin isn't backed by a physical asset like gold, neither are modern fiat currencies like the US dollar. Bitcoin's value is rooted in its scarcity, which distinguishes it from inflation-prone fiat currencies. The real story. There will only ever be 21 million Bitcoins in existence, and this scarcity is a fundamental driver of its value. Not only is the supply capped, but the rate of new Bitcoin creation decreases over time in a predictable manner. Approximately every four years, in an event known as a halving, the rewards paid to miners are reduced by half. This mechanism ensures that the supply continually decreases, aligning with the economic principle of scarcity and contributing to Bitcoin's long-term price appreciation, from less than a penny initially to over $50,000 per Bitcoin as of mid-February 2021. Bitcoin derives value from the computational work performed by the network's computers, a process known as mining. Powerful computers worldwide provide substantial processing power to validate and secure every transaction, 
and miners are rewarded with newly created Bitcoin in return. Myth number four, Bitcoin will be replaced by a competitor. Bitcoin was the first truly successful digital currency, and despite the emergence of numerous competing cryptocurrencies promising new features or advantages, none have come close to surpassing it. The Real Story Despite the creation of thousands of rival cryptocurrencies over the past decade, Bitcoin continues to hold the title of the most valuable cryptocurrency by market capitalization, often by a significant margin. Bitcoin is also the most widely adopted cryptocurrency, constituting around 60% of the total crypto market. Bitcoin's first mover advantage and its clear mission as a decentralized and open currency have contributed to its continued dominance. Bitcoin's decentralized nature allows for upgrades to its underlying architecture when needed. These upgrades require support from a 51% majority of the community, ensuring that Bitcoin can adapt and evolve. An example of this is Bitcoin's segregated witness, SegWit, upgrade in 2017. While it's possible for developers to create entirely new cryptocurrencies through a hard fork of the Bitcoin blockchain, none of these Bitcoin clones have come close to replacing the original. While innovation in the cryptocurrency space is ongoing, most experts believe that Bitcoin's replacement is unlikely in the foreseeable future given its current position and network effects. Myth number five. Investing in Bitcoin is gambling. Bitcoin has indeed experienced significant price volatility over the past decade, which is typical for a young and growing market. However, this volatility does not necessarily equate to gambling, and there are valid reasons for considering Bitcoin as a part of a diversified investment portfolio. The Complete Story There is a fundamental rationale for Bitcoin investors to believe that the value of their holdings should increase over time unlike gambling where the odds are typically skewed in favor of the house. While there are no guarantees regarding future performance, Bitcoin has demonstrated a long-term upward trend over the past decade. One popular investment strategy to mitigate the impact of volatility is dollar cost averaging. This approach involves investing a fixed amount at regular intervals, regardless of market conditions. Typically, this strategy results in positive returns in a positive trendline environment, irrespective of short-term fluctuations. Bitcoin's volatility appears to be decreasing over time. A recent analysis compared Bitcoin's recent bull run to the 2017 boom and found considerably lower volatility this time around. Factors contributing to this include the increasing involvement of institutional players and the maturation of cryptocurrency markets. Whether Bitcoin or any other cryptocurrency should be a part of an investment portfolio depends on individual circumstances, risk tolerance, and investment horizon. Given Bitcoin's historical performance, investors should exercise caution when navigating volatile markets and may consider seeking advice from a financial advisor before making significant investments. Myth number six, Bitcoin isn't secure. The Bitcoin network has never been successfully hacked and its open source code has undergone extensive scrutiny by security experts and computer scientists. Bitcoin also solved the double spend problem, making trustless peer-to-peer -peer digital currencies a reality. Additionally, Bitcoin transactions are irreversible. The real story. Misconceptions about Bitcoin security often arise from attacks on third-party businesses and services that utilize Bitcoin rather than the Bitcoin network itself. High-profile hacks of early Bitcoin companies with inadequate security measures and occasional data breaches affecting wallet providers, such as the Minty Gox incident in Japan and Ledger breach, have raised questions about Bitcoin's security. Bitcoin's core protocol has consistently operated securely, with an impressive 99.9% .9 uptime since its creation in 2009. The network's security is bolstered by a vast amount of computational power and miners are distributed worldwide, eliminating single points of failure. Myth number seven, Bitcoin is bad for the environment. Bitcoin mining is indeed energy intensive, but assessing its environmental impact is a complex endeavor. It's important to remember that all aspects of the digital economy consume energy. When considering energy use, one must also account for the global banking system, which requires significant energy to process transactions, power offices, ATMs, and local branches, among other functions. The Real Story 
Recent research conducted by New York-based fund ARK Investment Management has concluded that Bitcoin is much more efficient than traditional banking and gold mining on a global scale. A substantial portion of Bitcoin mining relies on renewable energy sources, including wind, hydro, and solar power. Estimates of the proportion of renewable energy used in Bitcoin mining range from 20% to over 70%, according to the Cambridge Bitcoin Electricity Consumption Index. The Cambridge researchers have determined that Bitcoin's environmental footprint currently remains marginal at best. Some argue that the economic incentives embedded in Bitcoin mining are driving innovation in sustainable energy. Miners continuously seek ways to lower electricity costs, and as renewable energy becomes increasingly cost-effective, it may further reduce Bitcoin's environmental impact. Myth number 8. Bitcoin is anonymous. Bitcoin is often misunderstood as an anonymous digital currency, but it operates on a transparent and public ledger called the blockchain. While Bitcoin transactions don't reveal personal information, the transaction details are recorded on the blockchain, accessible to anyone. Each transaction includes a sender, receiver, and the amount of Bitcoin transferred. While real identities aren't directly linked to Bitcoin addresses, blockchain analysis can identify patterns and connect addresses to individuals. Sophisticated techniques used by analysis companies and researchers allow them to track transaction flow and make educated guesses about address owners. Additionally, transactions involving regulated exchanges may require identification due to anti-money laundering and know-your-customer regulations. Myth number 9. Bitcoin is used only for illegal activities. Bitcoin's connection to illegal activities is a common misconception that overlooks its legitimate applications. While it's true that Bitcoin has been used for illicit transactions due to its pseudonymous nature, it's crucial to acknowledge that the majority of Bitcoin transactions are lawful and serve valid purposes. One significant legitimate use of Bitcoin is for online shopping, with many merchants and platforms accepting it as payment. From e-commerce websites to digital services, Bitcoin provides a decentralized and borderless method of global transactions. Busha has also introduced Busha Spend, a feature enabling users to spend their cryptocurrency directly from their Busha wallet. With Busha Spend, users can purchase airtime and data subscriptions for Nigerian mobile numbers, making everyday transactions more convenient and offering instant cashback rewards. In conclusion, despite its association with illegal activities, Bitcoin has widespread legitimate uses, providing secure and efficient transactions for individuals and businesses in the digital age. Myth number 10. Bitcoin is a Ponzi scheme. The claim that Bitcoin is a Ponzi scheme is baseless and misleading. Bitcoin is not a Ponzi scheme, but a decentralized digital currency operating on a peer-to-peer -peer network. Unlike a Ponzi scheme, Bitcoin does not rely on a central authority or promise unrealistic returns. Its value derives from market demand, scarcity, and utility. Transactions are transparently recorded on a blockchain accessible to all participants, making Bitcoin resistant to manipulation. It has gained widespread adoption, recognition, and regulatory frameworks, setting it apart from fraudulent schemes. While Bitcoin carries risks and volatility, labeling it as a Ponzi scheme is incorrect. Now that we have debunked the 10 biggest Bitcoin myths, it's clear that this digital currency holds immense potential and offers exciting opportunities. By understanding the truth behind these misconceptions, you are better equipped to navigate the world of Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. If you're eager to get started with Bitcoin and embark on your cryptocurrency journey, look no further than Busha our trusted cryptocurrency exchange platform. With Busha, you can easily buy, sell, and manage your cryptocurrency portfolio. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced user, Busha provides a simple and secure platform for all types of users. Don't let these myths deter you from exploring the world of Bitcoin. Take the first step and start your cryptocurrency journey with Busha. Embrace Bitcoin's possibilities and join the ever-growing community of digital currency enthusiasts. Download Busha to get started today and unlock the potential of this groundbreaking technology. Happy trading with Busha! So this was our today's video. I hope you all like it. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe the channel. Also share it with your friends and family. 
We will be back soon with a new video. Till then, keep supporting and take care.